super cool party people and welcome back to the vlog it is currently monday i took yesterday off because i was packing my bag in the morning getting ready for work and i looked at my camera and i was like nah and so i just didn't vlog yesterday and it, it was nice uh, i didn't do much i worked went for a drive attempted to go for a walk but it just kept starting to rain every time my friend and i were like let's do this so we didn't and then just kind of came home and chilled like my room is a disaster because i just didn't want to do anything watch some christmas shows and then i was just like so excited that I didn't have any orders so I could maybe work on my pajamas and then I got an order for I think it's like 12 or 14 scrunchies and a mask <laughs> at like 11 o'clock last night maybe 10 30 so I pulled all the fabric and I actually the nice thing was is some of the scrunchies I already have made four of them um but I pulled all the fabric yesterday I cut the mask I already have the liners cut and I just have these two patterns left to cut now for scrunchies so that's good at least um and while I did cut more than I need for the scrunchies like if I need it like one or two I cut like nine maybe I won't cut them all we'll see <laughs> anyways I don't know what my plan is for the day I slept in because I definitely needed to I had I've been having such crazy weird dreams lately and last night I had a a dream where I just kept trying to rap even though like I couldn't rap so I'd like start and I'd be like ha just kidding there was like Archie comics in it I was going into a house of like a t character on a show that I've watched and it was like it was such a weirdly designed house <sighs> it was weird it's just weird dreams I've been having weird dreams for like a week now and I just don't know why but that that's good that's fine I think what I want to do today is I want to cut the rest of the the fabric that I have there um, and start sewing things and do laundry because it's getting bad and like then eventually put that laundry away shower and I don't know there's probably a few other things I want to do I didn't set up my agenda yesterday because I was just like nah um, I didn't make a list for today because I was like no so I should probably do that but I think I'm gonna have my breakfast drink first because it's just been chilling here while I've been doing nothing and um, probably shower next first two steps of the day please excuse the mess that is just like everywhere but it's fine exciting things well yes and no so back in august i ordered some fabric it was a th there were some pieces that were a pre-order <laughs> and so it was supposed to get here on wednesday it got here today which is so exciting but also i don't need another eight meters of fabric at all oh well <laughs> And I wish I could say this was the last fabric that I had coming in the mail, but I do have another pre-order which should be shipping by the end of this month. It's fine. I don't really feel like I have enough time to do this unboxing, whatever, because my friend is gonna come pick me up in like 15 minutes or so, but I just, I, let's see the fabric. Okay, so here's the fabric I got. I got it from Birdie and Dot Fabrics. If you were wondering, they are a Canadian company. So I've been trying to, when I order online for fabric, I've been trying to support Canadian as much as possible. And um, they're pretty good. <laughs> I honestly couldn't even tell you. There's a few things I know that I got, but that. <laughs> So this is the first one. It's like a green flecked one. Couldn't tell you my process, my thought process behind getting any of these because it was literally, I distinctly remember it. I was in blind channel and I was like, everybody, I, I shouldn't order more fabric. And then I was like hiding in the corner ordering a bunch of fabric. I'm like, yes. So yeah, and this one I love. It's super cute. I think I got a meter and a half of it. If you look at it, it's just floral. But if you look closely, there are cats, cats in the floral. So that's really cool. I got this one specifically because my mom likes seahorses. So it's got seahorses on it. If she wants a mask, I will make her one. And then this one is the same uh, style and it's just snails. I don't know. They were just cute, honestly. Like the pre-order ended for the stuff in like October. And so it still hadn't shipped at the end of October. And part of me wanted to reach out. And if they're like, oh, we lost your order, I'd be like, just don't bother sending it because I did not need this much. Next, I got this floral one. The <laughs> flowers on it are much larger than I thought they were, but you know what? It's still super cute. I can work with that. Maybe oven pot holders if I ever make them. Then I just got this boring, but also pretty neat uh, geometric design. 
And last but not least, ooh, also a bigger pattern than I thought. It's this floral, but there's skunks in it. Yeah, so that was my most recent what have you done order. Um, again, look forward to another one coming at some point. It's actually kind of nice because I do have these fabrics from the other day that I have to wash. And so I was like, oh, I'll just wait till Wednesday and wash them all. I could still do that, but at least I have them all now. So that's where we're at. I just had lunch. I am going to change a little bit because I am in like capri sweatpants and it's only seven degrees out there. And I'm thinking that's probably not a good idea, but maybe I'll do it anyways. Should I do it? Should I do it? <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go now and I will check in with you along the way. bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time it's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can see <laughs> It's so beautiful, you and me, we meant to be, in the great outdoors, forever free. so I'm back from my walk and it's actually been quite a while I think I got home at like 3 30 and it's 10 to 5 now but it's fine because I have been moderately productive <laughs> my laundry is currently in the dryer I have folded all my laundry that was still washed it's not a lot because I mostly just rewore the clothes that I cleaned and I've like half organized here the plan right now is to cut the scrunchies in these two patterns while watching something on here and hopefully get these all done before I have to grab the laundry and then I'm gonna have dinner and then I think I'll drag my sewing machine up on my desk and sew. Feeling productive, especially considering like I was like, oh yeah, I'm good. I don't have anything that I need to make. I have to iron the mask too. The fabric was like super like uh, 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 before I can even sew it, but maybe I'll wait until I get to like the ironing part of the scrunchies. I don't know. We'll see. We'll just go with the flow. I just hate pulling the iron out. If we're being honest, who loves pulling an iron out and setting everything up? I'm thinking no one. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna get into this and I will check in with you later. Well, it's been a while, but I have a pile of scrunchies here. <laughs> Um, yeah, so everything's obviously cut and sewn. The threads are trimmed and I flipped them, so that's very exciting. It's been quite a while. It's been a pretty slow, chill evening, day, I don't know. It's after 10 o'clock now. I did wash all my new fabric. It's back there, it's folded. I have not folded my newly washed laundry it's probably just gonna end up back in the hamper if we're being honest but i feel like i've been relatively productive i still need to set up my agenda for the week because i have no idea what the heck i am doing ever um it's just finish these scrunchies and do that mask i have to sew so i think the plan for tomorrow is to iron all these tubes iron the mask and probably start sewing the mask because once these are ironed they're pretty i don't want to say quick but it's just pulling through the elastic and pinning them and then sewing them after. So it shouldn't be too bad. And it's not like a batch of like 200, which I've done uh, before. I think it's probably like one, two, three, four. It's probably like 50-ish just under. So reasonable. Anyways, I think I'm going to make myself a snack because I'm a little peckish. <laughs> and then um, come back up, get myself organized, and then probably go to bed relatively soon because it's um I have to work tomorrow yeah but I just want to check in because I know I have barely picked up the camera today but it's just because I've been 
feeling lazy, but also I've been being productive. <laughs> Seems counterproductive or like counterintuitive to say those two things, but it is what it is. Well, it's about midnight, so I guess it's time to go to sleep because I need to be up early for work. I really need to like stop staying up so late again. I was doing so good for like a solid two weeks where I was going to sleep before midnight and now I'm like yeah, it's midnight. Well, well maybe I should get into bed. Anyways I'm gonna do that now. <laughs> so with that I'm gonna say thanks for coming along on today's adventure. Although did we do much? I don't know. And I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.